Try it again. Welcome back to another episode of the Hermit Poetry Series. I'm Neil Aiken, and on this channel I read poetry, mostly work by contemporary poets, occasionally poems of my own, and once in a while poems from the past. Um, today's episode features a poem from Amber Flora Thomas's Eye of Water, published in 2005 by University of Pittsburgh Press. This was a 2004 Cave Canem Poetry Prize winner. Uh, the poem I'm going to read is entitled Dress. I turn the dress loose, its hand-sewn collar, its seven bodice buttons, the hem's frayed edge. I follow each stitch as it slips from its hold. I'll, I'll reconcile with time later this habit of proceeding from the smallest task unhurried. My arms draw back and fan the massive skirt. I lay the sleeve pieces to one side, unfold the waist ties, and stretch them flat. I cut out the fringes of buttonholes and lose hook and eye in my lap. I'm pulling open this mystery, knotted flaws where a seamstress hurried over her air, threaded paths ending in the hidden cusp of the waist. Lint sewn into a pocket seam, I take it from intricacy, from fragility, from a tenement of irreproachable lightness, no dress for a shoulder to ease against, a thigh burn on, none to take account of the crescent curve an arm makes, no angles coming to life on a hanger, just this current of bygones exhausting its hold. A neck hold that gapes for form, for the body it fitted, for sweats and perfumes, the hairs caught willy nilly in a fold, for the order begetting size and season. No memory unhooks down the breastbone swell and excuses me from today. Um, and that was Amber Flora Thomas, um, her poem Dress. Uh, if you enjoyed this poem, um, well, <laughs> if you enjoyed this poem, please like this video um, and check out the work of Amber Flora Thomas. I have uh, more information in the com in the in the description for this video. Um, if you uh, if you want to hear more, please uh, subscribe to this channel and check back often. I have new content every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday. Um, and I encourage you to keep checking out the work of other poets uh, that I introduce on this channel and still others that are waiting out there. Uh, the world of poetry is big, there are many voices, and there is much beauty um, and delight, wonder, awe, and rage. Um, and we can encounter all these things uh, within language, step into the life and into the mind of someone else, and uh, experience um, the emotion of... Uh, that we share across humanity. Um, so stay tuned and check back often. Um, and until next time, stay safe, stay well, and keep reading poetry, keep fighting the good fight, um, and we'll be back again soon. Take care.